Hello, Sandy here, out in the local neighbourhood. And do you have issues with being consistent and focused or any issues with consistency? Because I think sometimes people get mixed up. You know, they think that they have an issue with this. But actually, I want to give you a different perspective. I don't think that when you have an issue with consistency or being focused, it's an issue with that. I think it's actually an issue of self-belief. And, and why do I think that? Well, often, if you start something and you can see and you know that you will create success in whatever it is, then nothing can stop you from just heading towards that. But when you don't really have the self-belief that you will make it, it's really easy to get distracted or to get drawn to other things, to sort of take your focus away from what you were focusing on before, from your vision, from what you saw. And it's really easy to become distractible, you know? And people confuse the two, I believe. They think that it's an issue with not being persistent enough, not being consistent. But actually, it's an issue, like when you look deeper, it comes up with self-belief, you know? If you don't believe you can do something, then you're just, you just won't follow through, you'll stop. You know? And I know when I started to make daily videos, I had a lot of that kind of stuff. I could feel it happening in the first 30 days especially. The time it took really for me to create the habit that I was doing this. Oh, and here comes the train. There's a... There's a Portuguese train for you. <laughs> um, when you have that, that belief and that knowledge that you're going to do it, no matter what, then you become consistent because you become like a dog with a bone. You know you're not going to stop until that vision has become physical reality. And that's what happened with me with making videos. I just knew that I was going to create some change in my life and start to have more of an impact in the world no matter what. And that gave me the consistency because even though I didn't know how, and I did actually honestly doubt myself sometimes, I just committed to myself that I was going to do it. And that every single time I did that, you know, I, I had to choose that every single day over a whole year, it reinforced it and my self-belief grew, you know, like a habit. And I actually just want to show you a really cool house here, uh, which is very near where I live. I hope you can see that. It has like this rock um, balcony and then like glass uh, and it's, it's really quite nice and they have a pool just underneath you can see it reflecting so uh, anyway that's just kind of off the topic but <laughs> just walking past it thought I'd show it to you so when you have that self-belief you automatically become more consistent so if you are having issues with being consistent doing stuff on a regular basis then I'd encourage you to look at that and ask yourself do I really believe in myself that I can do this and if you can't do what you can to change that. Surround yourself with people who do believe in you and just start to, to commit every day that I am doing this and I can see it happening. I'm just going to keep going until it happens. All right, I hope you got something out of this. Let me know if you did. This has been Sandy in Sao Jao, the rest of it. See you soon.